J. Replying to your video. I'm glad that you got some more NBA to view. Sounds like you're not really going to get into it, which is, eh, that's all right. I'm glad you tried. Um, trying to think of things you said. Um, A, the two centers, I know one is Steven Adams, the other one that I can't pronounce, Vujicic or something like that. Those are both big motherfuckers, that's for sure. And um, the guy, I think, I'm, I'm not sure if his name is Vujicic or whatever. He's pretty good um, shooting threes usually. Um, but that's that's pr pretty much what it is now. They call them stretch fours and stretch fives instead of power forwards and centers because if you don't shoot from the outside and you're not a great rebounder, you have really no purpose in the league anymore. It's pretty cr crazy. Um, as far as Zion goes, uh, yeah, he brings the ball up, but I've been saying for a couple years now, it doesn't even matter. Like, you shouldn't even label anybody like a, a one through five. Um, LeBron brings the ball up. Sometimes the centers will bring it up. Nobody pressures the ball anymore. So it doesn't, as long as you are capable of dribbling, you can bring the ball up. It's just, it's just very weird. Um, I think Zion is going to be, still think he's going to be great. I did watch a little bit of that game, and I saw one of his, um, a couple of his drives. I saw a dunk. He's so explosive for his um, size. And he's not even 21 yet. He's still 20 years old. So I think he's going to grow more into that body. He's been compared between, what I think it's a great comparison, a miniature Shaq or an even bigger Barkley. That's what he is. He can shoot the three. Extremely um, nimble for his size. And I... I didn't watch what you saw, but I could. I know sometimes he does look like he's floppy or whatever. He's a little unorthodox, but um, and I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he is going to be a, a flop, but I think he's going to play for a long time, barring any injuries. Uh, I was just saying, I like the girls' nicknames. Z Science, Z Science could be a, a great nickname for him. Oh, uh, the guy you're talking about, John Morant. It's funny. Uh, Williamson was the first pick two years ago, and John Morant is uh, was the second pick. And yeah, he won the uh, Rookie of the Year last year. Uh, he's fantastic. He does everything. Um, there's so much good talent. Uh, the ball boy, the ball kid. Uh, he's actually a good dude. His dad just like a piece of shit and kind of. Uh, not ruined it, but put a target on his kids' backs. Um, his youngest, LaMelo Ball, is a rookie this year, and he's probably going to win Rookie of the Year. Uh, Lonzo, yeah, he's got a very unorthodox shot. He was great in college. But here's the thing. He does shoot from way down below. But the thing is, nobody like nobody's usually up in your face, so it doesn't matter how quick he releases. It's just, there's so many things now, like, Lonzo Ball could not have played in the NBA when we were watching it, because of that stupid shot. But nowadays, like, there is no defense, it's crazy, it's, like, a tight game at the end, maybe there's some defense, but, it's just crazy. But anyways, that's my review on your, um, NBA review. So, anyways, glad you watched it. Maybe you'll still watch it some more. Um, last score I checked, Memphis was down by like 20 points. So, uh, But I think Zion's going to be really good. And there's a kid from um, New Orleans named Brandon Ingram. Fantastic. Uh, so anyways, thanks for the update, and I'll talk to you later.